So we will see what will happen here. We're gonna get a hand warmer, it looks. Oh no, they're going straight into it. Here at Battlefield Game 1. Rippa does a good job for sure of placing his pills in a, in a way to stifle the opponent. Similarly to Falco's lasers, funny enough. Able to partially the driver's seat, but not anymore as the F Smash will kill super early at 74%. Yeah, Doc's, Doc's F Smash can definitely be scary if um, you DI it wrong. Arch trying to tie things up. Just kind of dash dancing a little bit, waiting for uh, waiting for Rip to come in. Gets the down air to knock him down, but Parch comes out of shield with an air to knock him away. Oh, and he will just barely outspace the dash attack and get one of, a, of his own. Can't take that stock though as Parch jumps up, ends it with a down air. We got three stocks apiece here. Rip with a, a bit of a uh, percentage lead though. Up air, oh, can't quite convert into the F smash. Parched lives on for the moment. Man. Really, really good neutral coming out. Neither of them want to overextend and get punished. Something that, that's something that both of their characters can do very well. Is a punish on an overextension. And I've got Cripple Tear joining me now. What's up? Oh, and Parched with an unfortunate SD, but Rip stays in the driver's seat. We'll see if he can finish this one out. Oh, oh damn. Yeah. two quick back airs will take that game. As we got the soft focused Rip and Parched. Yeah, Parched yeah, had to learn that dock matchup pretty fast. Yeah. Try to avoid being caped, especially on stage. Oh, Ooh, it's going for the Falcon. It's going to go Falcon. Rip just beat a Falcon, I do believe. Honestly, Rip does not like the Falcon matchup that much. So, uh, so I guess we'll see. And Parched's uh, Falcon is no slouch either. You might think because it's a secondary that you can't put in work, but I would disagree. The biggest thing is if Parch can get around uh, the bears off the stage. If, if he can't avoid them like Zach could, it's not going to really end well for him. Yeah. And so far, just kind of <laughs> getting hit. Not a whole lot of combos so far this game. A lot of uh, damage in neutral. Ooh. And unfortunately, we'll miss a Raptor boost, which will lead to his demise. Ooh, gets the grab off the up air. Tricky timing for sure. And oh, surprised he didn't go for a bear right there, but just want to get a few extra turns and throw him off. Oh, get that back air. Can he? Gets the grab. We'll back throw again. A bit of a rinse and repeat here. Gets the and back that's air, it. and that's yeah. the second stock. Rip goes up. Four stocks to two. Drop down there, we'll keep building that percent, but that, like I said, those uh, pills can really gum things up if you can't uh, avoid that. And a huge combo now. Yeah, definitely gotta make sure to tech it, because getting a hit by that forward smash is not good. Yeah, missed techs can be absolutely lethal against Dr. Mario. Pushable cape, but in the end, it's still... No, never mind. Smash. You managed to get back on the stage. Quite, I think he wanted a uh, JC grab there. Kid couldn't quite get it. Up there to knock him off stage, and Man, the forward tilt will take it. Yeah, he's been trying to implement forward tilt a lot more into his game plan. Rip, knocking on the door before stop. We'll see if uh, Parch can deny it. Continues to build that damage, knocks him away with the down smash and another yeah, one. that's it. And game two will go to Rip. It was a good try with the Falcon, but... Very commanding. We'll see um, what Parch does here. I don't... I feel like he's going to go back to Falco. He has to. 
Fox, maybe, but yeah, maybe. He'll go back to Falcon. He's like, I didn't think he was due to Falcon again. Yeah. Takes him back to Sabre. I think this is probably uh, <clears throat> Falco's best stage of the match. A good one for sure. Yes. And we see already a much more even game. Yeah. Just he... a 7% lead now for Rip, but Arch takes that percentage lead right back. Becker to knock him away. We'll avoid the get-up attack and knocks him off stage. We'll see if he can close this stock out. Not quite. Very close. The best time to hit him is when he but Doc is down being, so just jump up and back air would be the best oh, bet at that point. I love that air dodge there to avoid a uh, punish from uh, Parch coming off the ledge. Rip at kill percent. Parch just needs to find the move, and in there, yeah, not quite do, do it. it. Very close, and yeah, that one. Wait. Oh. No, no, yeah, he, he was smart. He held it. <laughs> Good to hold shield there on that forward air. Quick down air for a little bit of percent. And oh, avoids that get up attack, but can't quite get anything out of it. Very yeah. close. Should be it. Oh, that's what it, I'm sure that was supposed to be a jump up air. Yeah. We haven't really seen this parched in the driver's seat. I'm trying to take the second stock from a uh, anti air with the uh, up, up air. <laughs> I feel like Parch definitely slowed his game down a bit. Yeah, to make for sure. sure. He can carefully go around the dock. Absolutely something you need to do against a character like Dr. Mario. He's, he's uh, definitely shooting more lasers too. Also something you need to do to combat those pills. Well, the thing about shooting too many lasers is that if he does it too many times, uh, Doc can just start keeping him. Yeah. I think he's, I think he's, um, I don't think he's overdoing the lasers. I think he's keeping it. No, yeah, he definitely is. Moderate. <coughs> he's shooting only the ones that matter. Yeah. He's, uh, placing them a lot better. Yes. I should say. Up air, down air, and the down smash to knock him off stage yet again. I am. Oh, Ooh. unlucky as he will reflect that pill that takes the stage spike. Oh, the wave dash and jab, grab, and air. Oh. down air, dash attack, and up though. air. Won't quite barely, take it. They're barely living. Oh, oh, man. Very close. And the pill, a great pill there from Rip. And the back air will do it off the top. Parch now up just about a full stock. Air will convert into shine, but he can't get anything else off of it. This could be huge for Rip here as he knocks him off stage. Can't and quite. Oh, do another back throw. And he's just looking for the bear or the cave. Oh, no. and the forward air will knock him. The other way, that's actually a little bit unfortunate. But oh, oh, that connects. The up smash into a forward air, I believe. And this is almost even now. They're both <laughs> playing very calm and yes. neutral, just not trying to uh, run in and get punished. The pill will stop him from getting forward smashed. Can't quite convert with the up air. Down air, back air. Parch looking for anything to kill. Rip ultimately looking for a knockdown here to get a combo started. We'll see. Oh, and the barely not, quite. not a good spot. And okay, there, there it is. Yep. The back air will take game three. Is parts narrowly avoiding the 3 0. He's probably going to take him to Yoshi's now. Oh, no. FD, FD I, okay. I think, uh, I'm pretty sure Doc has a chain grab. <coughs> I don't know if Ripple will utilize it, but um, it does have a chain grab on Falco, I believe. 
butt part is also not a terrible stage for Falco, I would say. Yeah, he you can uh, really just shoot those lasers and space you out. Oh, wait. Oh, he, he doesn't go for the chain grab. He actually uh, tries to up smash him, which is also a good move um, off of the up throw on FD. And raw F smash. Took a jump too, even if he lived it. Mm -hmm. Oh, tries to read the tech. Can't quite. He's parched all over him now on that shield, just pressuring him. Up tilt into the shine. Like once again, just good good damage, really keeping uh keeping Rip from getting in with any of these combos. And he Short hop laser grab. Nope. And once again, the tech will avoid, Ooh. but rip with a huge F smash to even up the stocks. Once again, a lot of neutral here being played, but the raw down smash. We'll just take that stock for, for Parched. And once again, Rip uh, a little bit on the ropes here. There, back air. This, this, these little bits of damage are, are uh, adding up hugely for Parched. But he'll get the grab not quite at forward air percentage yet, I don't think. But we'll still clean it up and take that stock to even it up once again. This is an absolutely even matchup. In yeah. game three of this loser's final set. Yeah, it's very back and forth. So just playing very safe for the most part yeah. until one can get it the first hit in to start the combo. Uh, absolutely not wanting to get to punished. Rip, letting those uh, pills fly. Something that is really good for Doc, but Parched still finds a way in and gets the, the double dip to go up yet again. We'll see if Rip can uh, even the stocks another time in this game. He's really fishing for those grabs right now. Yeah. I think grab would be very good, but <clears throat> spamming it is a little bit risky. As you can see, Parched just continues to get that chip damage over and over with these weak aerials and lasers. Ooh, gets the, s the dash attack but can't quite convert. Up throw okay, forward air is yep. true at that percentage and it does kill on FD. So here we go, last dog game three of grand finals. Parch with a couple retreating lasers and Rip with a couple pills of his own. Oh, gets the back air. <laughs> a very good pill there from, oh. from Rip. Can't quite get that uh, up smash in again. And oh, now he gets the regrab. Oh, uh, he's doing it. And, uh, oh, but Parch gets out of it. But but Rip able to even it up. Nearly avoids the forward smash. That oh, it gets it. a grab. Forward that air is it. true, and yeah, that is it. it. The up throw into forward air combo, like I said, true until very high percentages on a Falco. What a game. What a set. And Rip will proceed. Versus bagels now. We've got bagels versus 